Mental retardation is a pervasive developmental disorder. Pervasive developmental disorders are classified as a group of conditions in which there is a delay in the development of communication and social skills. The Other Sister is the story of an ambitious young lady with mental retardation who has transcended many of her limitations while away at school. Okay. But even though Carla has worked hard to become educated, she is still seen by her family as a colicky little girl. Doing it. And I just wanted to know if you really know what that means. Yeah, that's what Thomas Porter calls it. And Mrs. Matthews, the health teacher and the cafeteria monitor, she called it coitus. And it, she also told us about penis okay, we've got and it. vulva. Shh, but, and then she was telling us all about Carla, semen honey. and how there's 50 mm -hmm. billion sperms in one you, shot. And that. No, 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 we, we do have the... Mental retardation can be caused by fragile X, Down syndrome, fetal alcohol syndrome, or circumstances like issues at birth or exposure to toxins. To be diagnosed as mentally retarded, individuals must meet the following diagnostic criteria. First, they must exhibit significantly sub-average intellectual functioning, which is defined as an IQ of approximately 70 or below on an individually administered IQ test. She has significant it. social adjustment problems, and now her school, what's drink. the matter? What are you drink? It's right there. Uh, and, and now this school, the regular school, won't even take her back. What about oh, that, Radley? Forget the drink, Radley! Now listen to me, we need to talk about Carla. Do you understand? We she have is beautiful to. if you look at her. She didn't even burn the house gorgeous. down with oh. the other two girls God, in it, Bradley. We can't that, do this. That was an accident. You it know was that not. Was we accident. can't keep saying things like that. We can't keep saying Carla is a slow learner. Carla will blossom because those are lives. Now, Bradley, we have to do right. something. We have to make a decision. This is a special school in Santa Barbara. It is, uh, it's uh, for the mentally up, just, challenged. That school put right yes, there. Now, they don't allow adults and the parents to go visit them. They, they have limited, do. limited visitation. And let me tell you something, Radley. If it doesn't work out, I she doesn't have to be I there. I don't want her to be retired. Of course you don't. Second, they must exhibit concurrent deficits or impairments in present adaptive functioning in at least two of the following areas. is the new you, the old you. Good, not so good. <laughs> okay, anyone else for a free makeover demonstration? But when are you gonna do the rest of my face? This is a demonstration, and this demonstration was absolutely free. Oh, but how much is it to buy the other half of my face? About $50. But I don't have fifty dollars. Oh, well then, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to take the next customer then. So if you could just move aside. But you didn't say anything about fifty dollars before. Come on, everybody knows the whole thing isn't free. Winnie, your mother said another fifteen minutes. Did you tell her that I don't like tennis still? She said that all well-bred girls play tennis, chess, or bridge. Oh. Is it 15 minutes yet? Excuse me, sir. Does this bus go to La Pine Street? No, this is the eastbound. You want the westbound over there. But I took four buses already. I don't know what to tell you, but that bus will take you there. Okay. Thank you very much. It's so good. Third, the onset is prior to 18 years of age. Adult mental retardation can also come about from toxic exposure and trauma, most likely from the brain. Carla, dear, can you please try to eat it with your fork? And that would be very, Carla, with your fork. No, no, dear. I said with the fork, not with the knife, dear. Uh, all right. No, no, no more cake. No, no. Excuse me. I will, I will. No, no, wait a minute. Oh, my God. I told you, I can't, stupid. Stop laughing at me! We feel it's important to mention severity because although Carla faces hardship because of her condition, she is actually a high-functioning subject. We can't measure a movie character's IQ, but if we were to guess, Carla probably has mild mental retardation. Individuals with more severe mental retardation have a harder time adjusting to societal norms. I also enrolled her in a calligraphy class, an origami class, and I, 
I even got her into that... She doesn't want to do those things. They, they don't interest her. They don't work for her. Maybe Carla doesn't know what works for her. And you do. I think so. I'm her mother. That's why she's trying to hitchhike over 200 miles to get back here? Would she do that again? I believe she will, yes, if things continue at home the way they've been going. Yes, absolutely, yes. And we were lucky this time. She came back here. A lot of kids run away. We never hear from them again. Oh. This is a girl who is determined to push the edge of the envelope. And I, for one, I like the fact that she never quits. Specifically, she wants to attend this uh, uh, Bay Area Polytech. A public vocational school? Is that what you're talking about? They do welding there. She can't possibly keep up with that. And she's going to be humiliated by those people You don't there. know who they're going to humiliate. Of course they're going to humiliate her. Please. They, they did it when she was uh, young. She's I'm... got to have the opportunity to meet challenges. I mean, do you, want to, do you want the kid to remain a child the rest of her life? Or do you want to let her grow into an adult and take the same risks that you and I did? I want her to take risks. It's the kind of risk. Are you a parent? Uh, no, not yet, no. But I have worked with children, including yours, for 10 years. You think she should go to school and be on her own? Independence can give Carla something that you and I will never be able to give her. Dignity. What? Dignity. The most effective treatments are individualized educational and skill plans that are based on the child's needs. Families can benefit from family therapy by learning to cope with the stress and other day-to-day -day activities involved with raising a child with mental retardation. Carla and her family struggle with the idea of her independence, just like any other child seeking to leave the nest. Very much. I know he does, but Carla, I just don't think that he can take care of you. He can barely take care of himself. We can take care of each other. We don't need you, mother. But don't worry. You don't have to come to my wedding. I'll do my own wedding. I hated everything you did for Caroline's wedding. I had the dumb hat and these dumb shoes and your big ugly centerpieces. The only thing I like is this dress. This is pretty. Okay. I'm gonna keep it. Oh, oh. oh. oh my god. <laughs> Come back inside. No! Please. I'm gonna please. do my wedding all by myself. And if you don't like Daniel, I don't care. Don't come, because Daniel will be there for sure. I'm going home, my Carla, boss. come back! No! Please! Oh, oh. but Carla, Carla! Carla is a good example of how an individual with mental retardation can be transformed into an independent young adult. She goes on to bond with her family members, enrolls in vocational school, and gets married to the man she loves. Oh, no, no, Carla. And then a teacher yeah, no, no, would come no, Carla. All right, just don't move your hips like that. Don't do this. Don't do that. Just keep it calm down there.
Joseph. Paul. Eyes right. Congratulations, Marla and Dan. <laughs> okay. Anyone else for a free makeover demonstration?